Wow. I don't know if you can feel anything from this, but I definitely do feel things from this. It is like light. It is, uh, that's the only way of saying it, is light, it's prana, energy, life that's flowing in my body is in exactly in the same way that this is happening. And we've picked out the most juiciest one. So there's six more, this is the seventh. So we're gonna eat this, enjoy it. So we'll pause the camera and uh, we'll return when we're feasting on this. This is the next video in the clip and I'm gonna show you the second ash gourd. You see, it's ashy. Uh, that's why they, uh, they call it ashy, ash gourd. I'm just realizing that. And the ashes reminds me of vibhuti or sacred ash. And it's fantastic, it's phenomenal. I wonder if there's any purpose or benefit to the ash that seeps out of this. But uh, yeah, you know, Shiva is, when he burnt up uh, lust within him, ash seeped out of him. And this is uh, the same thing that's happening to this fruit. It's very ashy, it's becoming very ashy. So it's like Shiva's fruit or Shiva's food. And it's very apparent and a very fitting that this fruit gives off ash being the most pranic food on planet earth so it's amazing it's fantastic i just want to rub this ash all over myself why because this food is so pranically dense it's so good so i'm going to show you the second one and i'm going to hold two in my hand i don't think that's going to be possible but here's the one that uh, we're going to enjoy also so we've got two very very ashy ash cord okay that's it stay tuned until we eat it Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. This is the third video, and I'm gonna eat this watermelon. Here we go. Uh, very juicy, very pranic, very nutritious, very delicious, very... I don't know any other words that rhyme with that. So let me just see. This is just too precious to just simply cut open willy-nilly, and I'm just really uh, figuring out where to cut it. And also, it's very dense. It's not like a watermelon you could just watermelon like I've eaten hundreds of watermelons here but this is different so I'm gonna show you okay this is a sharp knife very sharp knife very sharp knife and is hard to go inside okay so that's how it shows you the dense density of this thing as well as uh, uh, okay I'm just gonna cut it who cares Hopefully I don't get my nice white shirt, all pranic, covered in pranic juice. Oh, I hope we have a, have a blender here because ash gourd juice is probably the most beneficial thing you can drink. And uh, since ash gourd is quite difficult to eat because again, it's so dense and it's so chewy and it's so pranic and it's so delicious. It takes a while for you to eat this. Okay, here we go. The most pranic food in the world, ladies and gentlemen, first bite. Here we go, everybody knows the rules. I'm not joking, I'm not exaggerating. This part I'm not gonna eat. We'll put it down here for safekeeping. And what else is there to do to ladies and gentlemen except to eat the whole thing? Uh, it's actually much more delicious than I expected. Last time I ate this, I was like, oh, I can't really eat a lot of this. I'm going to eat a lot of this. Maybe I'm going to eat half of this. And my cameraman is going to eat the other half. Shout out to him. Uh, you know who you are. And um, that's it, ladies and gentlemen. Go out there. Get yourself some pranic food. Get yourself some ash gourd. Plant ash gourd in your house. Winter melon in your garden. Do whatever you can, okay? It's not available in stores. You got to really look for it. It's uh, definitely available in uh, tropical countries. But in the Western countries, it's difficult. Or just go to the Isha Yoga Center and ask for some ash gourd. They'll definitely give you some. It's phenomenal. Oh my God, now I'm feeling the effects. It's like, let me eat more and I'm gonna really uh, walk you through it, how it feels, because uh, I wanna document this. I need to document this for all of you young viewers out there. Here we go, baby. Winter melon, ash gourd. Woohoo! Oh yeah, see, lots of seeds. So it's not been poisonly uh, castrated or chemically castrated. It's uh, very, very nice. Okay, here we go.
Too many seeds. I'll eat them. Way too many seeds. Shout out to you out there watching me eat an ash gourd, bunch of melon. As well as, it's starting to kick in, meaning I'm feeling the light entering my body. And what does it feel like? It feels like if you're in a dim room and you start to turn the lights, very nice, bright lights, white lights, and it feels, ooh, lights are coming on, ooh, feels very nice. Or it feels like, um, there's a second example, uh, maybe when it's a really dim and cloudy day like it is outside, and then it's cloudy, 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 and then all of a sudden the sun comes out. You're like, ooh, wow. That's exactly what this feels like, okay? It's a feeling. So lots of prana. Texture is like there's no fruits that come close to this. Maybe like a pineapple, but denser. But the taste is like it's so mild, it's so uh, watery. It tastes like winter. You know, English words or whatever, they're okay. But this one was very close to the actual reality. It creates a lot of coolness in your system. That's why probably they may they call it winter melon. So whoever ate this was really in tune with them with their senses. And it tastes like winter. It tastes like, I don't know, you go and eat an ice cube or you eat um, some snow. It tastes like that. I don't know if snow really doesn't taste like much. But if it was slightly sweet snow, or if it had a little bit of nice naturey sugar inside of the snow, this is what it would taste like. Nice snowy fruit. I don't want to waste this. It's too good. Like the video. Like the video. Okay, like the video. And I'll share with you a little secret about manifestation. That, um, you know, I always wanted to eat this when I first heard about Sadhguru talking about it in 2019. I'm like, oh, I want to get this for myself. And then I Googled it in Toronto. Hey, where can I get some ash gourd? None. No available. I went to grocery stores. None. They didn't have it. Some little superfood stores, uh, they said they had it, but they didn't have it. And then I'm like, okay, I, I want to get this. I need to get this. And then I just kind of threw my intention out there. And then now it's finally fruited. I didn't have to pay for this. Someone generously donated a gigantic, full, fresh, ripe winter melon. Okay, shout out to you. Um... I'm sorry, you know who you are. And uh, I cut it myself off the ground, and this is the 
It hasn't been even 24 hours since I cut it and we're eating this. So right fresh from the ground. It's so delicious, so juicy. Uh, I'm tempted to eat another slice. I will eat another slice. Just one more. So it's the, the trifecta. That uh, was a problem last, yes, last time with the uh, seeds. I have to do something about that. I don't want to be uh, growing a water bunter melon in my uh, in my stomach. Uh, I apologize for the technical difficulties. There's nothing technical about this, but here we go. Okay, let me cut this. Wow. Now what am I feeling like? I'm feeling like it just feels energy is beginning to be built up again. My body feels very nice. And uh, I'm sure that once I eat the whole thing, I'll record one more video talking about my uh, the effects of it. Here, cheers, here we go. It feels like I've just done a lot of kundalini meditation. And energy's uh, rising up and I feel like I'm in a lot of light. Like I just took a, a shower in some sacred little pond or river or something else. So it feels very magical, very beautiful. This is Ash Court, ladies and gentlemen. Uh, shout out to you for the person that uh, gave me this. Thank you so much. And uh, shout out to you, the person watching me. Like this video and go get yourself some Ash Court. And what else to say? If you want to talk to me, reach out to me. The price is $120 Canadian. We'll chat. I'll change your life. I'll fix any of your problems internally. Whatever you're dealing with, I'll help you. Okay, I'll help you. And uh, so link will be down below to pay me and then um, message me on Facebook. And join my Discord. We have a lot of fun there. The link will be down below. And what else, to say? what else is there to say? Go get yourself some Ash Cord and I'm going to enjoy this. And uh, I'll add one more video, a bonus video after I eat this. All right, cheers. That's it, ladies and gentlemen. This is the last I ate as much as I can. My stomach is full. My body is feeling in light. And it's just quite amazing. It makes me feel so wonderful knowing that this is such a fruit is alive and available on earth. And if you make juice out of it and you can drink it, you can consume more and more light will enter into you. As well as, it's just fantastic. It's amazing. It, make me, it makes me see what light is and what prana is and how much it's needed. And um, yeah, it's a shame that I can't consume more because my stomach is full, can't eat any of me, but I, I want the light, I want the benefit. And um, if there was a way for me to drink the light inside of myself without eating the fruit, I would definitely do that. But unfortunately, that's not the case. I have to eat the fruit to get the light inside of me. It's fantastic, it's amazing. I love life, I love Ash Gourd. And it also makes me see the contrast between eating a uh, high pranic food like this and let's say going out and eating some burger with french fries and how dull and senseless you will feel. So um, it's my wish and my desire for all of you to experience this, this blessing of eating this uh, ginormous fruit, uh, ash gourd winter melon. And I hope that you do. I hope this uh, finds your way into your life and you will experience it and taste this for yourselves.